You ready? Hello, my name is Wayne Thomas. I'm with Kind at Heart Ministries. I am, I've got the pleasure today to be here with Miss Leslie. Uh, our organization got to meet Miss Les Leslie last week, and uh, we was amazed at her story. She actually, we got to hear about a woman that is close to God, and we kind of wanted to share that story with you today. Leslie, you want to say hi to everybody? Hi. Hi. <laughs> Well, Leslie's story, actually, she's been, uh, she has cerebral palsy, and she's lived here in our community for about 17 years, but she has a big heart, and she's really close to God, and uh, she's been doing a lot of cool things, uh, and we're going to bring that out here in a minute, but Leslie, won't you go ahead and tell them a little bit about your condition and where you are, and kind of like I did there. But. Well, I was born with cerebral palsy, but that hasn't slowed me down as much as the arthritis that is kicked into my knees in the last year or so. And this is the first time in my life that I've been in a lot of pain and I can't get out and do the things that I like to do, like with my plants and even just going to the mailbox. Yeah. Just going out the door is hard for me yeah. and dangerous for me. Yeah. And you, you actually are looking for hope. I mean, our application was for a scooter. Mm -hmm. You're looking for a scooter, aren't you? Yeah. And that scooter it's going to help you go outside and around to take care of things and you would that would be a blessing to you wouldn't it to go to the mailbox to see a couple neighbors to see my son to work in my yard again to awesome. feed my birds and awesome. raise butterflies <laughs> now you claimed several times just when being here today that you've been praying for this to be met and you're confident that it's the Lord's going to meet it's going to happen <laughs> amen amen okay well uh just a little bit, I wanted to, she actually has these blankets. And last year, how many blankets did you make? Last year I made 50, but the first year I made 150, and that was about three, four years ago. Okay, and you send these to where? The American Legions picks them up for the disabled veterans. Oh, wow. So you got a mission to make so many of these a year. Yeah. And she also has a card here, a day spring card, that she actually writes in here, and she's already started... Uh, uh, thank you for your service. Have a very Merry Christmas and blessed New Year. So she started her, her production for Christmas coming up. And so she's got these blankets. They are just beautiful. She makes, and then she has these this little hat here. Tell me a little bit about that hat. The baby hats are for the preemie babies in the hospitals. And I sent them from hospitals to, from Tulsa to, to Little Rock. Okay. And how many did you make last year? Last year I made 300. 300, ain't that awesome? And then you have this hat. Then I made, I think, over 100 of those hats last year. Oh, wow, wow. And 50 of them went to St. Jude's, 10 went to the veterans, and then 10 to other places. Wow, wow, that is so amazing. Now, we also, something that caught her, she, she this is her little journal. Uh, actually is, I'm assuming it's a day spring journal. Mm -hmm. You had mentioned she loves day spring journal. But let me catch my breath. But she actually, this is special to you, isn't it? Mm -hmm. So you spend a lot of time writing. And and uh, can you tell me a little bit about why the colors are the way they are? I use the colors to brighten up the verses in my, my day and to make things stand out to help me remember verses and special sayings to help other people. Oh, wow, wow. Hmm. And you have three of these, you said, right now? Well, I have one like that, and then I have, I think this is my third book, that I write letters to God. Oh, you write letters to God? And this is kind of like a Jesus calling type of, you know what the Jesus calling yeah, is? Yeah, I have Jesus oh, calling. Oh, you have Jesus calling, too. I read it every day. <laughs> but this is, this is, <laughs> this is uh, your own personal Jesus calling, mm -hmm. like of writing letters to God, so... That's awesome, I'm sure. Well, uh, wow. You amaze me, Leslie. I mean, she is an amazing person. We have been, had the privilege, haven't we, Luke, to sit here That's and right. just talk yep. to her and, and get to meet her a little more. And she's just been doing so much, even the simple things for God that probably nobody even notices. And uh, she's very humble. She's even been giving credit to everybody else for it. Well, we're excited for you, Leslie. And I know God's going to answer your prayer. Amen. Amen. All right. Well, thank you for your testimony. Appreciate you. Thank you for caring. Okay. All right.